The raging fire destroyed a piece of history, house of worship, and place many diverse New Yorkers called home in the East Village. I thought I was in a nightmare. I thought it was a, I was living in a nightmare. It was an out-of-body experience to imagine that it's pouring down rain and you see orange flames coming out of your sanctuary. The massive six-alarm fire started at a vacant building, then jumped to Middle Collegiate Church on 2nd Avenue and gutted it early Saturday morning, bringing overwhelming grief to members of the congregation who stood in the rain and watched as firefighters tried to save the steeple. These buildings are very stable, but we, um, the, the age of it can be a factor and the combustibility of the interior. The historic and progressive church was built in 1892, but its history goes back to the 1600s. It was once home to New York's Liberty Bell at a different location, rung in 1776 for the signing of the Declaration of Independence, and has also rung to commemorate inaugurations and deaths of U.S. presidents. We have been the collegiate church since 1628. 1628, the oldest continuous Protestant church in North America, the longest worshiping community in this nation, and the oldest corporation. We're not going anywhere. The fire will not stop our revolutionary love. It is um, a queer, friendly, loving, straight, gay, trans, bi, every ethnicity, multi-generational, from toddlers to to the 80-year-old to the senior. Lila Boyer is one of its 1,400 members. One of the hardest things I had to face being here uh, was just my sexual identity. You know, coming out, being out, being in a church where I felt like I belonged and that I was safe. Now that the Tiffany stained glass windows are gone, the sanctuary destroyed all in the middle of the pandemic. During one of the most hopeful times of the year, church members are focused on rebuilding with resilience. That we are gutted, like our building is gutted. We are sad. We are crestfallen. But we are here. No one died, thanks be to God. This is your time to show up for Middle Collegiate Church. Middle Collegiate Church has showed up for you. They have opened doors when others have closed doors. And a live look at the scene at this hour. The streets here are still closed. Firefighters are still on the scene. Police are here, Department of Buildings. We're told four firefighters suffered minor injuries. They are expected to be okay. Two other buildings were damaged. The cause of this fire does remain under investigation, but again, just a sad day for the congregation and this neighborhood. We're told worshiping will continue tomorrow as it has been since the pandemic started back in March. As for rebuilding, if you would like to make a donation, a contribution, head over to our website, pix11.com for that information. We're live from the East Village tonight. Jennifer Bisram, Pix11 News.